the real community and in our online communities. How can we be uh, good Samaritans to each other? We focus on being good Samaritans um, every day of our life instead of um, one particular week or one particular day or one particular even subject. You can give some of uh, yours to them. I think when you focus on uh, service to others and love for others, I think that's where you see an impact. If you focus on the bullying word and the anti-bullying word, it gets to be a, only a bullying will get, the word will only be the thing that's getting something in recognition. I think there's so much more to showing that service to others and hu humanity, to being human and to being respectful. And so when you can show all the, all the love and the attention and, and giving of yourself to others, I think that's where the focus is and I think kids play into that and they buy into that and they're willing to help out. I'm trying to make a difference very slowly. How are you trying to make a difference? Um, if I see bullying, try to stop it, which hasn't happened yet because there's not a lot of bullying in our school. At St. Jerome, we, um, we, we encourage students to to look for someone who is struggling outside um, in the classroom, giving a hand to someone who is um, struggling in a subject. If they've dropped something, I have multiple students, sometimes five or six students, who come rushing to the aid of someone else who's dropped something. I learned that it's not nice to bully. Do you ever see bullying? Yes. And what do you do if you see someone being bullied? Try to tell them to stop. Coming to tell um, teachers when, when somebody's being bullied or when somebody is hurting in some way. And what do you do if you see bullying? Um, you shouldn't just stand there and watch uh, people getting bullied. You should help the person that's getting bullied. How do you do that? Um, you, could at, like, you could say, hey, come play with me. Or you could tell the bully to quit. Smile, give a hug. Um, share something with, encourage people to come into games when they're by themselves. Um, looking to also include um, special needs students who are part of our school here. I've had students that are out on the playground and somebody has said something mean to them. And I've, after recess, have three or four students, girls and boys, come up to me and say, so and so was picked on and then it's my job to take care of that, right? And to help them out. We are all different, and it's really hard in our world to be friends with everyone, um, and unreasonable. But can we show love to everyone? Absolutely. And can we show respect to everyone? Yeah, we can. We can accept everyone for their differences and um, agree to, to share for the better good instead of just, you know, focused on ourselves. Can you give me an example of how we show respect? Like, yeah.